down the wrong rabbit hole. But beggars can't be true. Hmm? So let's make a deal. You help us, and you don't die. A win-win, yeah? Not that you have much choice here. Back off, Doc. Hey, kid, I know what you're thinking. What could sound more appealing than a slimy stranger giving you orders? Trust me, I know the feeling. But listen, this place has gone to hell. It's getting worse fast. Richtofen is stepping up to repair our teleportation device. But it's not going to be an easy job. You find us and provide some support, and you might actually make it out of here. The speck of good news in all this is that there are still some supplies scattered around this dump. Get yourself armed and maybe mow down an undead ugly or two on the way over. A broken clock is right twice a day, yes? Well, that is German and his plan. Consider it the first correct strike of day. As a doctor, I'm afraid it is my duty to break bad news. By passing through the rift, your world has been affected by the ether. Ether energy has the power to tear open the seams of the multiverse itself, allowing humans and objects to shuttle in and out of time and space. Our coming here was cured by accident. Outside the defensive umbrella, they can't stand the storm. Be careful! That's not a toy. Listen to me carefully. At night, the bases will attract no end of dangerous creatures. If it is destroyed, we'll be torn to pieces by the stormy second. Bastards are here, guns are loaded. Let's get this started. Nightfall, so we can prepare. 
I've sent for salvage we gathered from several scattered vehicles your way. Use it wisely. Running vehicles are rare commodities. And should you happen to use one, exercise caution. The Isa storm paralyzes motors when night falls. Because, of course they do. is raging at night. It should be able to provide enough energy to help us reopen the portal. As for you, I'm afraid if you don't make it back on time, we won't wait for you. Don't let poor punctuality be your downfall. Get those bastards away from it! <laughs> 